Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across a VirtualBox error. VTX is not available in Windows 10. Failed to open a session for the virtual machine. So you're coming across this issue. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it without too much of a hassle here. So first thing you want to do is make sure your computer supports hardware virtualization as well as hardware DEP or data execution prevention. In order to do that, we're going to easily be able to find out. So I'm going to have a link in the description of the video to the publisher's website for this utility, Securable. You want to go ahead and select the Download Now option. You can see there's been over 5 million downloads of the software, so pretty well used here. We're going to go ahead and open it up once it's on downloading. Select Yes if you're greeted with a user account control prompt. And as long as hardware DEP says yes and hardware virtualization is in the green, you're good. So mine says locked on. If it says yes, that's fine as well. If this says no, your computer is not going to support it. Just stop watching this tutorial. Your hardware just does not support virtualization. If there's anything red in here that says no, you might as well just stop this tutorial. So with that out of the way, close out of there. If everything was good to go, we're going to now move ahead, open up the start menu, type in Windows Features. Best match to come back with turn Windows Features on or off. Go ahead and left click on that. Should be something that says Hyper V. You want to check mark inside this box here, expand it as well, and then check mark whatever options are available under it. Select OK. And once it's done, you might have to restart your computer, so I'd suggest clicking restart now. And that should be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.